Yeah, hi, in this video I'm going to show you on how to create the depreciation relating to the sum of digits method. So here we have the sum of digits method here. So you can use the business scenario and what is the business example and the system demo for the business example. Then the configuration steps and what is the master data maintenance and also the invoice posting and asset reporting and depreciation graph. So when you look into the business example for the sum of digits method, so let's say you bought an asset for the cost 800,000. So if you look here, you bought this for 800,000 and the life of the asset is five years. Now the salvage value or a residual value is 50,000. Then if you look into here, so let's say the life of the asset is five years. So now you take all these years, when you sum up, it's actually you can see here the sum of all these numbers comes to 15. So you have to keep in a revert order. So let's say when there is a number one here, so this all go in the inverted order. So let's say you take this from the inverted order, then you have to divide here. So you take, this is a formula where you are taking the inverting order. This is a fixed and five divided by 15. What is the fraction here? So you will get fraction for each of the year. So if you look into here, I'm dividing everything by 15, but when I revert it, this is, not, this is coming year one will be number five, two will be four, and three will be three, four will be two, five will be one. So when I divide, you can see five divided by 15, and four divided by 15, and again 3 divided by 15, and 2 divided by 15, and 1 divided by 15. So this is how you will get the fraction. So now, what is the component depreciable, you can see here. So 70,000 where I minus salvage value which is 50k. So the depreciable amount is 75 750,000. So now, if you look into the depreciation here, so you need to take, uh, after deducting the residual value, so the value should be multiplied with the fraction is 0.33. So now you will get this amount. So here, you have to do this for all across uh, the five years. So after you adding up all these, so you can see this is the total depreciation, sorry, this is the total depreciation how the system is going to post and this amount will be left as a residual value. So now at the fifth year, the system is going to calculate 50,000 based on multiplying the cost minus residual value with this fraction. So this is how we use uh, depreciation by sum of year digits method. Thank you.